I understand that you have a governor here who is trying to <laughs> who is trying to destroy the trade union movement. Well, I've got some bad news for him. And that is, if elected president of the United States, we're going to do everything that we can to rebuild the trade union movement in this country. Without a strong labor movement, there will not be a strong middle class. And we're going to pass legislation that will make it easier for workers to join unions. If 50% of the workers in a bargaining unit plus one vote to sign a card to join a union, they will have a union. If a company refuses to negotiate a first contract with that union, that company will be severely penalized. And a lot of people, a lot of people don't understand this. But when workers negotiate good contracts for their members, it impacts every worker in the community because wages go up for everybody. In my 25 years in Congress, I have a 98% AFL-CIO voting record. And I'm not sure that I was the guy who was wrong on that 2%. So, I am not a candidate who goes to the unions and goes to workers and leaves and goes to a fundraiser with Wall Street. You are my family. And I have worked with unions for my entire life and with working people. That is what this campaign is about. That's what I've been about my whole life. So thank you all very much for what you have done in fighting for the rights of working people. There is nothing more important than that.